Hi, my name is Luciana Scarabello. I'm 30 years old and I'm a contemporary women's wear designer. I decided to shoot this video in my house, which is actually where I work as well. Right now I'm sitting here in my living room and we will walk through towards the bedroom, which is where I do all the sewing and the pattern making. This is my bedroom and this is where I do most of my designs. I also do my samples and my patterns. Uh, I have fabric here behind me, as you can see, very unorganized. Um, I also have my sewing machines here, cutting table, and well, further that way I have some samples that you can't see. Um, because this is a small company, I haven't been able to have a real office, and that's why I had to do everything from here. Though it is convenient because I do get inspired at different hours, so it's good when you get inspired to get to work, because that's when the good ideas actually do come in. Uh, regarding who helps me in this company, the biggest help to me are my mother and my father. My mother helps me with all the sewing and my father is the one that does all the numbers and the logistics. He also ships everything from his house, so I filled his house up with boxes, but um, they are my parents, so they do everything for me. He's the one filming this right now, actually. Hi, Dad. <laughs> Um, besides that, I do work with a production manager in New York. When I finish my sample and my patterns, I ship everything to her, and she's the one that's in charge of arranging production with the different factories. And regarding sales, I work with a showroom in Miami that is called Allure Showroom. It, um, they're the ones that are in charge of doing all the sales, and we also do participate in some, some trade shows, like the ones in Las Vegas, like Project and eventually we want to do culture in New York as well. I get inspired by... But mostly I get inspired by women because I'm designing for them. I want to make clothes that makes them feel unique, special and modern and um, have to do with what women actually are and what they want nowadays in modern days. Now back to my collections, um, if I had to pick a signature piece I would have to go with Chuck. It's funny, I actually call all my dresses by boys' names. Um, I think it's easier for us to, to remember the styles and I like the irony of calling them guys' names. This style I did three years ago when my company was smaller and it became an instant bestseller. So the clients I was selling to, they started reordering and the other stores were calling me because they heard about this dress wanting to carry the line as well. Now what this dress taught me was um, a balance between the soft side of a woman and femininity, which are identified in the ruffles, as well as a modern silhouette and also sexy and confident. Now because of this item, I started creating my line around it, so I kind of did things like this that still represent some of the softness silhouettes, but still sexy and tight something like this, which is a different type, well this has pleats, but it kind of imitates the ruffle look, and something also like this. Being able to participate in the show is a great opportunity, and being able to win it is, it could be actually life-changing. It would be the opportunity I always wanted to brand my company and myself. I think the show offers this unique platform where consumers can actually see what happens backstage so they actually do get to know the designers. I think this could be very interesting to brand myself. Um, nowadays, due to social media, it gets easier to help this interaction. Eventually, what I would like to do is to have people give their opinions about what they like to see in the line, what they like, what they don't, what they would like to wear, and eventually make them feel like they're part of the creation process. So then when they see Scarabello, they see my name out there, they feel like they're part of it and that creates consumer loyalty eventually. This has been a very long road to go and it has not been easy. I really had to make a lot of sacrifices. There is a lot of pressure, a lot of competition in this industry. And that phrase, you're just as good as your last collection, it's actually true. If your last collection doesn't sell, your clients are not buying from you anymore and everything you've been working for the past year could be gone. So that is a lot of pressure to take. Um, I think we can wrap this video up. I want to thank you for this opportunity and I really, really look forward to being part of the show. It would mean the world to me. I will not disappoint you. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.